name is Kathy Thomas and my company is Collective 615. The challenges that I faced before working with Angela was kind of prioritizing, setting clear expectations and also doing a little bit of delegating and follow through. I actually seen Angela speak on a previous occasion and I was just really impressed with the way she collected herself, the message she delivered, felt like she was able to speak to a broad range of attendees, which I thought was pretty impressive. And so when I initially reached out to her, it was on the basis of talking to her about public speaking. And then it kind of spiraled into sharing with her my new business venture, what direction I was taking it. She had a lot of interest in that. And right then we started instantly adapting in what she could do for the business, how she could help me develop the brand, how she could help me guide me through all of the operational efficiencies uh, immediately, which was great. I mean, after our first initial phone conversation, she had given me probably about two or three different nuggets that I was able to take away just to get the course of action moving. And then every follow-up meeting since then, I definitely got another two to three nuggets per every meeting that I could actually take true action on and see a result I mean, almost immediately. I would say and come into it with a very open mind and come into it knowing that you know you might not implement everything right away but every time you walk away take the things that you know as a business owner that you can implement use those and put the rest on the back burner so you don't get overwhelmed but follow the course of action she lays out because it really can become very fluid and make sense while you're addressing every single little nugget that you can address on your own keep all the information intact but again don't get overwhelmed by it a theme song for my business um high hopes would definitely be the theme song for my business it's one of those songs it's kind of like same with like greatest showman right like it's one of those things if you if you hear that song and you don't if you listen to it but you don't hear it um, you won't get it, but if you listen to it and you actually hear the message, it, it, I think it speaks to a lot of small business owners. I think it speaks to a lot of solopreneurs. I and mean, it just talks a lot about building the foundation and staying the course. Um, and it happens. It might not happen for everybody, but it does happen for those select few who put the work in.